Today we are in Spring Hill and we're with my parents and we just looked on the map to see where we wanted to eat and we came across Turnpike's Rest, rest Stop Bistro and Pub. It's got really good reviews. I think like 4.6, 4.7, 4.8. Doesn't look like a very big place. This is what we do though. Let's go check it out. See Turnpike's Rest Stop Bistro and Pub. Come hungry Wednesday through Sunday, nine to three. All right, here we go. I guess they're open nine to three. Special burger with side, seven twenty-five. Cake of the day. Looks like you pay right up front. Look at all the license plates in here. Interesting. I'm guessing restrooms are right back there, possibly. Doesn't appear very big. So that was kind of weird. We were sitting in there waiting and they said, can we ask that you wait outside and then we'll call your name. So we are outside. We did get a little menu and it looks like they got quite a bit of food, but I'll show you the menu. I might show you the menu now actually, cause there's no music playing. So no copyright issues. Here's what we got. Dine in, carry out delivery through uber eats we've got some starters and desserts waffle nachos. oh waffle nachos yeah well, i wonder what i wonder what that's like all right let's open it up breakfast served all day some french toast pancakes waffles skillets and in the middle page is just advertisements and over here, lunch and dinner served all day. I think online, they really had a ton of pictures of their Reuben, which is up top there. Burger done your way. All right, and then more advertisements, more advertisements. Do we see any drinks anywhere? I don't think we saw the drinks. Oh, sides down there too, I think. I and I don't know if it showed, I don't see anything that shows like gluten-free, gluten-friendly, but there's the menu. I'm just gonna show this sign again in case we didn't show it very good in the beginning, but since, it says on the door, since 2019, so they must just be fairly recently new. 2021 gold winner for sandwich shop. And then over here, 2022 gold winner for best diner, 2022 gold winner for best family restaurant, 2022 for silver winner for best deli. And now that we're able to come inside here, we're going to be right over here in this spot. So I actually lied. We're at this table. There's the door. We're right here. I thought we were over there, but currently right here. And then there's the restroom right over in that corner. And I don't know. I don't know if there's one over there or not, but so that's the men's and then that's the women's restroom. That's how they are doing the restrooms. We can show you the menu again super fast like this. Now we want to make note that we just found, oh, ask about our gluten-free vegetarian menu. So they do have a gluten-free menu, but over here you can see split plate charge of $2.50. And there's actually no music in here, so it's, it's fine to do it this way. But like I said, I already showed you the smaller menu that had everything on it anyway. I'm not sure what I'm gonna get, probably a Reuben because they are claiming that they are a really good deli restaurant. So do that and then sangria choices. They've got an Easter platter coming up. This is interesting. Any sandwich can be made into a salad. So I could do a Reuben salad. That's something, a Reuben salad. That is an interesting take on everything. I just don't know what these dessert nachos are either. I just saw a burger come out and it's massive and it looks really good. So either do the Reuben or a burger, but I don't know yet. I think Timber's gonna do the chicken club salad. I might do a burger just because, I mean, they were huge. So I might do a burger, do uh, cheese with it, maybe a side of barbecue sauce or something if they can do that because it did look really good and really big. 
I always like trying the Reuben, so I don't know what to do. Look at the cake they have up there. Wow. Would you do the burger or the Reuben? Reuben, please. Single or double? Single, please. All right, so I asked, I don't know if you can hear that, but I asked if I should get a Reuben or a burger, and they said Reuben. And then the side was the potato salad. If you make it into a salad, though, you don't get a side. So that's kind of strange. Also, I just went to the water today, and it's good water. Someone just tried ordering a burger, and they just said they're sold out of burgers right now. All right, here's a look at the salad. That looks like a really good salad. Look at the Reuben, how big it is. This is the Reuben. Potato salad looks good. All looks good there. You got the BLT with the chips. And then you got the berry and cheesecake French toast. Looks like large portions. I mean, this is massive. And that's just the single. You could get a double. But, and then that looks good. I'm very excited for this. That is very good. That is a really good Reuben. Thumbs up. Oh, here is the French cheesecake French toast. Also very good. Now let's try. Potato salad. There's something missing in the potato salad. Maybe like mayonnaise or mustard or something. Mm, I wouldn't necessarily get it again. Try one of these. Oh, they're good. They're very good. How's your salad? I love the cheese. Again, this Reuben is fantastic. It's very good. Potato salad, not good. I wouldn't, I wouldn't get it again. I would definitely get the Reuben again though. It's good. So that sandwich was massive. I'm actually really full right now. It was good though. So the one thing we noticed about the salad is there's actually not much lettuce. It's mostly just topping. Like tomatoes, onions, lots of onions in there and tomatoes. Also, it's freezing in here. That is blowing right on us. So it is pretty cold in here. So just know that coming in. Back there in the far corner, they have t-shirts for $20 you can buy. And I also believe it's pay up front when you get your bill. All right, now we are heading outside and you do pay up here. All right, we are back outside. I just looked and it, the bill was $52.60. $52.60. Again, it's kind of windy out here, so sorry if it's a little loud, but that was our stop at Turnpike's Rest Stop. I'm I'm torn. I'm 50-50 right now. Things I really liked. It was an excellent Reuben. Very, very good Reuben. Top-notch Reuben. Potato salad was not good. They definitely missed some sort of ingredient. It just didn't really have a taste at all. Um, it's very small. I think I counted nine tables, so a little awkward if you're trying to film in there. Their desserts looked good, though. We passed it this time, but passed it up this time, but the desserts looked good. My mom's was good. Salad though, the, the chicken wasn't very good and there wasn't much lettuce. Lots of onions and tomatoes. I'm 50-50 on this one. I will say if you like a Reuben, I would maybe go back, get the Reuben and get the chips because their chips were great. Um, but there's a reason I guess they say they are like top deli because I'm sure all their sandwiches are good. Apparently their burgers are good because they sold out of burgers, which is kind of strange, but they must have really good burgers. Anyway, I don't know. That gives you a place to try if you're looking for kind of a unique little spot here in Spring Hill. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.